I was hoarding before it was even cool to hoard during COVID. You've been putting on deodorant all wrong. Who says so? Science. That's what's in the story. Uh, okay. Science. First, do we know the difference. Everybody here knows the difference between antiperspirants and deodorant. <laughs> Thank you, Coop. Yeah, so ladies and gentlemen, it's time for deodorant Science. on the MJ Morning Show. Go ahead. You guys know the difference between antiperspirant and deodorant, right? Yeah, antiperspirant. Mm -hmm. Makes you it, not, not perspire. perspire, you know, the, the beads of sweat. And a deodorant is supposed to take away the odor that can be caused by perspiring. Yes, exactly. The deodorant helps neutralize odor and bacteria all right, all right, so what's, on the skin. What's, what, how are we doing deodorant all wrong? Let me tell you what. I, I get out of the shower in the morning. Okay, let me I'm, picture I'm this. Not a, I'm not a nighttime sh showerer. You know, a, a lot of... I do both. A, a lot of folks... I'm a double upper. A, a lot of radio people over the years, I found out, like morning radio, they'll take their shower before they go to bed. That's gross. No, I, I want to take a shower when I get out of bed. You want to sleep we, in your daily filth. We do We do sweat <laughs> at night. Yeah. You do. You know, you lose weight. Sometimes you could go to bed and you could wake up like two and a half pounds lighter in the morning. Oh, you're always your lightest in the morning. Don't I think I've heard stats that like over the lifetime of your mattress, you have actually <laughs> sweated like 27,000 gallons of sweat into Ooh. your bed. That's about right. Yeah. Judging by the sweat stains that's, that, on my mattress. That's one night with Fester. That's it. That's like, that, that was last week. You've heard of One Night in Bangkok? One Night with Fester. Do we play that song? One Night in Bangkok. I don't, I don't think. Hey, Coop, do we play that song on Q105? I've heard it. Uh, is it by Murray Head? Yeah, do we have that? Uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. One Night with Fester. Uh, ironically. Make a tough man tumble or crumble or whatever. One night in Bangkok yeah. makes a hard man humble. Oh, hard yes. man humble. I'll make <laughs> a hard man humble with yeah. One Night in Bangkok. Gotcha. All right, so how, how are we doing deodorant all wrong? Okay, because normally, like you just described, you put on deodorant. Oh, when you wake up in the morning. Hey, Festa was just envisioning me getting out of the shower in the yeah. morning. Yeah. yeah. And, then, <laughs> and you, go straight, uh -huh. you go straight to the Bangkok song. <laughs> All right. Moving on. This. How are we doing it wrong, Rock? Yeah. <laughs> well, what you're supposed to do, according to this science, is put on the antiperspirant at night before you go to bed. It blocks your sweat ducts. And then when you wake up in the morning, you put on more deodorant. What's a sweat duct? Where your sweat comes out of? No, not a, not a, not a duck. A duck. Not a duck. Quack, quack. No. Stop sweating, quack. Quack, quack. Not a duck. It's a duck. Oh, oh. So like the tape. So you need two different like. Yes. You only have one kind of deodorant, don't you, MJ? I have like I have like Menon, the the cheap Menon. Menon. Yeah. Oh. By, By Menon. I Menin. use Secret. They don't do yeah. that anymore, do they? Remember, I, they? remember that commercial? Every commercial. By Menon. I have the Speed Stick. By Menon. Four pack from Walmart. By Menon. I think it disintegrates when it gets near your pit, doesn't it? No, because it's like the gel one, right? And it, but it's a. Oh, I hate gels. It's all like cool Ew, and you sticky. Use gel. Oh, gel is the God. way to go. How old are you? It gets all on your shirt. Why are you in you, seventh grade? Why don't you just take AIM toothpaste and smear it under your armpits? Oh, if, dude, if I wanted my, my pits God. to be minty fresh, I would. Dude, no, the slide of the gels. What do you use? Like the white chalky yes. guy? Yes. Yes. Oh. People oh. are just. Disgusting. Gel deodorants are the worst because they go on. It's like They're gloopy. It, it's gloopy. It's the it's, it's cold. cold. It's okay. got that cold, drippy, wet stuff. And, and then, then you like rubs your arm. And then and you, it... you put your armpit and then down. Your and armpits you're like, oh, like oh, make squeaky, God. squeaky, gloopy noises. Nothing no. is more gross than people who raise their arm and you see little white balls of deodorant <laughs> dingle I hanging don't, from I their armpit. I don't have there. deodorant dingle oh, hanging that's out. The of, worst. I never get oh. deodorant dingle. You know what I'm talking about. Yeah, by the way, if you're ever at, like, uh, Walmart, for instance, and you're looking for the sure unscented solid and the whole row is sold out. It's because of MJ. I was there. Yeah. <laughs> I, seriously, uh, about once a year, I buy whatever's on the shelf. If there are 12 on the shelf, I buy them. If there are 15 on the shelf, I clean it out. I, I don't like. God, what a hoarder! Well, well, I, you know what? I was hoarding before it was. Hoarding. It was even it was, a thing. A coin hoarding. It, I was hoarding before it was even cool to hoard during COVID. All right. No, but I, I just I don't like going to the store and buying toothpaste. So I like my toothpaste. 
My tooth. Can you guys guess what toothpaste I use? Do you have any idea? Baking soda <sighs> with a little water. No, you know you're close though. But no, no. I, no I, I don't use the bake- baking soda brand. Uh, yes. Do you use with fluoride? I use yes. I use the Armand Hammer Peroxicare. Oh yeah. I've been using that, like that. Been using that for years. And oh, they, they, good for you, armpit diva. Yeah. They, they've ch- they've changed the they've changed the formula like nineteen times. And you know when you use something and you're like you know what it's supposed to be like. And it used to be grittier, which is better. It feels like your teeth are really getting clean. So like, w- what toothpaste do you use, Roxanne? I use Colgate. Just standard old Colgate. No, 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 no. It's uh, got all kinds of stuff in it. It's like, like good for your like, gums, like good meth? for your... <laughs> like, 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 like what? Like it's got pe- whitener in it, pepper- for sure. Pepperoni chunks? It's got pepperoni chunks. Oh, <laughs> yummy. Yeah. New pepperoni. <laughs> kind of makes you gag a little bit in the morning, but new, new from what a Colgate. way to start your day. New pepperoni flavored Colgate toothpaste. Festa, what do you use? We're close up people. Really? You use close up? That's you, like so 70s. You know why? You know why? Do you, do you yeah. know why? I don't know why. Because that's what they have at the dollar store. It's the biggest tube they have at the dollar serious? store. Yeah. I, I, I buy deodorant. I buy, I, for a long time, I bought deodorant and tooth bra- toothbrush stuff at uh, the dollar store. Festa, what brand, I'm sorry, uh, Froggy, what brand of toothpaste do you use? I use Kalinos. <laughs> what? Kalinos. K O L Y N O S? You never heard of it? What? I have to buy it at Cracker Barrels from the sixties. <laughs> you, you, you don't. You never heard of Colin? No. I, you, oh, it, dude, this is the stuff right here. Oh, I use. You know what I use? I forgot. I use New Ipana. All right, so I type. Oh, brush, up, brush, up, brush. New <laughs> Ipana toothpaste. Yeah, with a brand new flavor. Yeah, you know that oh, from. You know that from Greece, right? <laughs> yeah. Hey, Roxanne. From, you know that from the movie Greece. <laughs> that joke was stupid. Yeah. Yes, Sandy. Uh, I, I use new IPA. Right, so we're doing deodorant. All, so you said, give me the give me the rules again for deodorant. Oh, MJ, you know my. I use Secret. I, to be real, I use Secret. I told you the other day. I oh, use oh. women's deodorant. Uh, the, for for Froggy's deodorant, true. We're not talking about tooth. He doesn't use tooth uh, Secret Gallius. in his mouth. No, but no, Froggy does use women's Secret. Yes, <laughs> that's his secret. It's and the only thing that works. It's strong enough for a man. P. That's P. what they're they're women. advertising. Have they dropped that tagline? Well, it's true. So they sh- they shouldn't. It's strong enough for a man, but made for a man. Or it's strong enough for an it and made for an it. Like, it's strong enough for they. With all the all this stuff going on. It's, yeah, I find that secret for commercial a man, offensive. But made for a woman, but that, could be used by a binary. That, seriously, could have been used by that, <laughs> that character on the Billions TV show. Uh, so that was the old slogan for secret deodorant. Strong enough for a man, but made for a woman. Yes. And you know what? They'd probably be canceled these days. Everyone's so sensitive about everything. I'm, mm. All right, so quick, I got to move on to this day. Yeah, so just put on this antiperspirant at night. It's gonna it's gonna clog your pores. You won't sweat all at all. Right, so you put oh. on antiperspirant at night and then deodorant in the morning. Yes. But the problem is that typically these products are antiperspirant and deodorants. Yeah. I, do they? I, I don't know if they separate them. I any. think the point is to put it on at night. You would never think to put it on before you went to bed, but now it's saying put it on before you go to bed and then put on more right. in the morning. 